Hello everyone, welcome to Monday, November the 3rd. It is only quarter to six, but quarter to six equals pitch blackness, because that's what happens in the winter. And uh, that's just a thing that we now have to get used to, the lack of sun. I was at my desk in the sunroom, and during the day it's so nice, because the sun's out, and it's warm, and 3PO's like chilling in the sun on the, the floor, um, and then it's like four o'clock. And, and it's like golden hour at like four o'clock sun setting. I'm like, oh man, days are short. But anyways, I'm just making some sauce because some nice warm pasta I think is gonna be great tonight. I don't know if you guys know this, but for my birthday, Corey got me the Motorola 360 watch and it's really cool. And uh, a couple people have asked for like a little review on it. So I'm gonna tell you all about the watch. So the watch is pretty cool. Um, I don't think, right off the bat, I don't think it's something that everyone should get. It's really good because it basically is an extension of your phone. So any notification that my phone gets, it's shown on the watch, but you can't always necessarily interact with it in the sense of like, if you get a Facebook message, the watch pops up and like, Facebook notification, and then you can dismiss it, or you can go to see more information, but the more information is just um, it opening up on your phone. So it's not like a mini version of your phone. It's really good for notifications because like if I get an email, it pops up on my, on my phone and then my watch, and then I kind of look at the watch and I can, emails you can read, so I can like read the email and you can delete it or archive it. Um, I think it can reply to the email. I haven't really tried it yet but it's just good for notifications and for chat because we all use Google Chat. So when we use Google Chat, it pops up on the wrist and then you can just say, you know, like, you can click reply and then you can speak your reply. So it's good, it's good for that. It's good for driving because it has all the directions on your wrist, which is really cool. So when I'm driving, instead of like trying to look over at my phone, I can just look at my wrist, which is nice. Uh, it also has this really cool like motion activation. It's like when you turn your wrist like that, it turns on, which is pretty cool. So you could, it's off most of the time. I have a lot of questions about battery life. I get about two days on a charge. Whoop, almost fell. I get about two days on a charge, which is pretty good. Yeah, all in all, I think it's great. Um, I like it because I get a lot of notifications. Like I get it, as you, you can imagine, you get a ton of emails, a lot of chats, um, and it's great for that. But you know, if you don't have a lot of emails and you don't do a lot of chatting, um, well, if you do Facebook chat, I don't think you can reply through Facebook chat yet. It's pretty much just Google stuff. So, unless you do a lot of Google chatting and a lot of emails, it's not necessarily the best, but it is a nice watch, aside from everything else. And it is cool because it does heart rate monitoring, step monitoring. Also, you can change your music through it, so if you're like, you know, going for a jog or something, you can voice command activate it and it all just kind of goes through your phone, but it's a really neat way to kind of use your an extension of the phone. I hope that makes sense. I like it. I recommend it. It's fun. It's a neat little toy. Not for everyone, but if you think it's for you, the Motorola 360 is pretty nice. Oh look, I got a, a Twitter notification. So I can swipe it up to see more details or I can swipe it away to dismiss it. So it's neat. I like it. Daily vlogs, I want them in my subscription box. I wonder who might drop by, even though sometimes it's Canada outside. So don't go away, we're here every day. It's not Apprentice A, it's Apprentice A. Hey, 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 hey.